Welcome back to my channel. This is Gladys here. I'm super duper excited because this is the long awaited house tour for 2020, guys. I cannot wait for you guys to see what I have done. You guys have seen me decorate and clean and things like that. Now we get to see the whole house tour today. Let's go in and let's get started. Let's go, guys. <laughs> his only son so that whoever believe in him will not perish but have eternal life and that is the true meaning of Christmas for me and my family and I wanted to bring that into my decor just sweet cozy and comfortable I feel like Christmas is not all about the glades and glam especially when that's not what your meaning is and especially when that's not your decoration style. I hope you enjoy my home in this Christmas 2020. I know it's not easy, but I hope through watching my decor and Christmas arrangement, you may feel peace, hope, and joy in your heart this Christmas season. So I'm gonna go through some of these items, not all, because this is only a Christmas house tour and not a whole house tour. <laughs> Even though you're going to see majority of my home, I'm gonna show you guys where I purchased most of the Christmas items because I want you to enjoy the home without hearing my voice every minute of the way. So this year, my Christmas decoration, I really wanted to incorporate lots of coziness with throw blankets and you know warmth. So this throw blanket is from Ross and the Merry Christmas pillow is from Hobby Lobby. As you can see, my living room is very small, so I do not want to cramp it with a lot of things. We intentionally went for this model home because the layout was narrow and things were smaller. And you may ask yourself why? Because we got rid of almost 60% of our things and wanted to live a minimal and clutter-free life. So Christmas was not going to be an exception. I did not want to bring a lot of things in the home and feeling like Christmas puked in here. So we went this we went with this beautiful six feet tree from Walmart and I love it. I have a couple of ornaments on there that brings us joy and the topper I get a lot of questions when I post a video or a picture on Instagram. It's from Goodwill, but it was originally purchased at Hobby Lobby because the tag was left on there. And the stockings are from Hobby Lobby as well, guys. I love the sweater material. 
I think it's really pretty and it brings so much texture and warmth in the home. Leave it in the comment below guys, when do you start decorating for Christmas or when do you start leaving gifts under the Christmas tree? I started about a week ago and I still got some more to go. So I have this empty space right there which I'm going to go ahead and fill with more great gifts as I start to wrap them there. So for my kitchen, I really wanted to add just a little bit of Christmas there, so I added this wreath from the Dollar Tree and this, um, I believe, Santa, Santa Claus calendar um, from, uh, I believe it's from Dollar General, yes, and this beautiful tree right here is from Goodwill, so I just kept it very simple. A nice this one right there the Merry Christmas sign is also from Dollar General guys you don't have to pack it everything in your home to feel like Christmas just a little hint here and there it's all you need guys so I'm gonna take you guys upstairs now so we can see how it's decorated for Christmas but before we do that I wanted to show you guys my entryway because we didn't get a chance to see that this is right at the front door when you enter this table greets you there and I kept it very simple with a cute floral and just a bottle brush Christmas tree with a couple of candles in my candle holders sconces on the wall and it's just so simple and I love the way that looks like now let's go upstairs and see how we got it decked out there for Christmas guys so don't forget that your bedroom is your sanctuary when you're tired and weak from work you just want to come here and lounge and the last thing you want is clutter and things filling up everywhere on the floor so before leaving the house please do make your bed clean it may sound like a very simple tax but it is actually a very important one of the day so I kept my bed very simple with just a couple of reef and you know some Christmas um, pillows here and there a little bit drapes on my bed and the chair here and I think is good enough the last thing I want when I come home is to remove a lot of things before I can sleep or relax I just want to come to a clean home and simple and I also wanted to bring the joy of downstairs in here by adding this pop of red merry and bright Christmas pillow which I love love so much guys <laughs> you enjoying this video if yes please do not forget to click on that like button show me some love if you're not subscribed please do click on the subscription button I would truly appreciate it let's continue the video guys So this will be all for the video guys but I wanted to leave you guys with some nighttime you know shot I waited until it got dark so I can film this view for you guys for me this is 
the definition of coziness. What do you guys think? I really, really enjoy this, guys. And don't forget, there is more videos coming your way. So please don't forget to click on that subscription button. The house tour is not done. There is upstairs. But I did not want to put in this video because the last thing I want is for you to sit here to watch a 40-minute video. <laughs> so I'm going to split this in two parts. Enjoy the rest of your day or your night. God bless you guys. Don't forget the reason for the season, guys. Bye, guys. See ya.